Welcome to our first video market report on what's happening in the marketplace over the last six months in Brisbane. We're producing this video from the iconic Riparian Plaza here in one of the most amazing apartments you'll ever see. Well, it's the end of the financial year and what an amazing six months we've had in Brisbane. Starting off in January with the devastating floods that hit the Brisbane River and surrounding areas. And whilst devastating, the reality is that in Brisbane, only 2% of the residential market was actually affected by the floods. Obviously riverfront homes and those suburbs surrounded by the river were affected. And we have seen obviously dramatic price reductions in those areas. But overall, the market in Brisbane, now whilst it's been tougher, and there's no doubt it's been tougher compared to the 09 and 010 years, but there's still plenty of activity. We're seeing lots of buyers, we're seeing good numbers come through our open houses, and there's still plenty of sales happening. There's a lot of talk about a two-speed economy. What we're finding in real estate is there's probably a four-speed real estate market. Certainly the upper end of the market has seen some dramatic drops in prices, and it's a very, very tough market to be selling in. One of the real positives right now is rentals. Our rental market over the last three to four months has been firing. Rents are going up, driven by a shortage of rental properties, plus also a lot of executive rentals and people coming to Brisbane because of the mining boom. There's head offices opening up here. Rio Tinto recently just opened a new office in town and that's drawing a lot of people to our marketplace. Another market that's performing very, very strongly is our bottom end investment apartment market based on obviously the returns that we're getting in town. Our apartments in the inner city, priced between 200 and 600, are moving strongly. We're seeing investors coming back into the marketplace. We're also seeing owner occupiers buying cheaper apartments and cheaper inner city properties due to grants. And also the fact now that it's probably becoming cheaper to buy than it is to rent right now in the inner city of Brisbane. Another market that's performing strongly is our housing market in the inner city. This marketplace between 400 and a million dollars is seeing good interest from buyers. A recent example of this was a property that we marketed at Heidelberg Street in East Brisbane. Introducing Nigel Somerville from our South Brisbane office. Nigel, you recently marketed a property at 1 Heidelberg Street, East Brisbane. Um, just tell us a little bit about the home. Dean, beautiful property, uh, four bedroom, three bathroom, Queensland, uh, in-ground pool, manicured gardens, Heidelberg Street, East Brisbane. Yeah, it was a beautiful home. Now, in regards to the marketing, we took it to auction. Uh, you marketed the property over a four week period. Just tell us about some of the things you did. We did a video presentation. We did digital marketing, professional photography, database marketing, four weeks Courier Mail, four weeks Brisbane News, eight open for inspections. In regards to the database marketing, um, what did you do there? Well, we did a video presentation that went out to oh, over 10,000 people on our, on our database um, throughout the Urban Living Group, and uh, we had huge responses from that. Yep. And the number of people who actually buyers who came through the property? 120 groups through the Open for Inspection. Yeah, it's a fantastic result. Yeah, Obviously, the more buyers you get through, the better price you get. So just tell us about the actual results of the auction. Well, we had six offers prior to auction, yep. uh, and we kept those buyers there. And on the night, we had um, 11 registered bidders and a sale of 960,000 under the hammer. Fantastic result. So happy owners. Happy owners. And happy buyers. Yeah, very, very happy buyers. Yeah, it was a great result. Um, recently, Nigel, you've done four auction campaigns. Uh, yep. And, and great response in all four. Uh, sold four, out of the four, sold three under the hammer. Yep. And all with, obviously, extensive marketing programs. Just uh, the magic of marketing in this market is, uh, is you know, is what's, what's required. The fourth speed, and the marketplace that's probably most effective, is our upper end. There's no doubt in this marketplace that prices in the upper end, whether it be riverfront homes or luxury apartments like the one I'm in, are having a tough time. There's buyers out there, but no doubt this is the marketplace that's been most affected by the economy. An example of this was our sales in June. Traditionally, we're an office that always sells properties over a million dollars. But in June, we sold 36 properties. We had a great month. But all those sales were between 200 and 960,000 being our top. This is a rare event for our office. For more information about what's happening in the marketplace, we produce a quarterly report. You can get one of these by emailing me. We've got some exciting upcoming events. We've got our urban living auctions at the Emporium Hotel in the Valley. Over 30 properties going up for auction on that day. There's no doubt in this marketplace, you have to aggressively market property. The more buyers you get through your property, the more chance you have of finding that buyer who's going to pay the premium price. And really that's what we're here about. We're here to get the best prices for our clients.